Western 10 years ago, so give or take, um, studied, um, studied composition. And, um, and now, 10 years later, we have a, a, um, uh, among the, the, the PhD composition students at Northwestern is Ben Zucker, um, who I um, know from someone in, in California, um, and went to uh, high school in California, and, and knows um, and it's many of the same people that I that I worked with there and been part of many of the same um, uh, concerts and organizations and, and endeavors and I got I, I think we were to, we were living in the Bay Area for about one whole year and I and I had um, and I got to have. Um, been in all of my weird ensembles during that year <laughs> uh, 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 until he he went off to Northwestern after that. So, um, but um, so now I have to come out, come out here to get to uh, to do anything with him. So he has um, composed uh, a piece. Um, uh, where both of us are going to play in and and also for. Um, so any number of instruments, in this case two instruments and electronics, and, and it's called Refinites. Did I say that right? Mm -hmm. I, so. I don't know, I don't know myself. Yeah. <laughs> so it might be called Refinites uh, until, until further notice. And, um, and we'll, we will do that, and we may uh, follow that up with um, uh, something else. <laughs> we, may, we may follow it up with something else. We won't.
CDs from the various things that I've done, um, and, and um, especially uh, CDs from, from projects that um, are that are bringing together sort of, um, the, the various uh, things that I've done in my life in two in two coming from two areas in particular, coming from um, uh, black gospel music and, and and worship traditions and and experimental music and. 
really trying to figure out what it means to, to be doing both of those and what it means to do them at the same time. Mm -hmm. um, and, and, and finding that they don't, they don't, they aren't the same thing and that, and that, mm -hmm. um, and, and that it's interesting to, to listen to, to, to separate musical elements as if they're two people talking to each other, as, yeah. as if they're two, two, two entities that have a dialogue, have a conversation, that learn from each other, challenge each other, um, li listen to each other, sometimes harmonize with each other even, mm -hmm. um, and all of the above is there. So I, so, um, I uh, have uh, two of my CDs from the sort of avant gospel <laughs> that, that are um, available for for ten dollars if you like to, if, if you're interested in, you don't have one yet some people do um, and it, so I have a solo CD where I was doing this all as a soloist and trying to have trying to you know with with one hand play these traditional melodies and rhythms and with the other hand you know experiments and new kinds of harmonies and some rhythms that, that and create that musical dialogue with my two my two hands or with or with the um, the difference or musical characteristics of the of the piece might might suggest different voices and different tra traditions. And, um, and the the other one is my ensemble, my instrumental instrumental vocal ensemble, instrumental poetry ensemble, all, all of the above, called Trouble Ensemble. Mm -hmm. um, it's really uh, taking um, the the endeavor, the musical endeavor. Of the, of this avant gospel excursion, and, and also kind of the uh, the the spiritual endeavor, um, and you know experiencing the, the divine, and and through this this musical conversation, and also the political um, endeavor, the radical nature of both of those traditions, and the way that both of them kind of challenge the status quo in really big and important. So, um, so, there, so there's a trouble ensemble album is called uh, "In the Water," and, um, and the solo album is, is called "Heard the Voices." So you can know more about everything that way. So I think um, that's it. So I have one more um, thing that I'm going to do.
going to. And, um, and he's right, there's lots of people from all parts of his life here, including Joan, who we've known the whole, pretty much the whole 20 years we've been here in Chicago, to Andrew's new friend, Mike, who is from the uh, Forte Community Music Program. And um, my, he and I are sort of work colleagues together in the plan giving world. So thanks, Chris, and Megan, and Ben, and this is great. So thanks again. <laughs>